okay. I actually didn't, I, I didn't think this would happen. Welcome back to our channel. If you guys have not subscribed to our channel yet, I'm not really sure why. Make sure you click that subscribe button and click the notification button so you can receive all the notifications whenever we upload a video. Yeah, we are just standing in the boys' room. I actually thought, are we camping out in the woods right now? Hey guys, there's a pencil book right there. Ew, what in the world? Oh my gosh. Did you like just find this? Okay, can you please get that, Ollie? No. That is so creepy. There's a pincher bug. What do you guys call this bug where you live? Because where I live, we call them pincher bugs. But I know that people all over the world call them. No, no, no. Don't <laughs> call them all different things. So let me okay, know yeah. what you call that. We put it on a Hot Wheels track. And we're tossing it outside. Yeah. Bye, pincher bug. Hey guys, when are we gonna open the stove? Uh, yeah, check out what's behind there. Show them, Ollie. This is the craziest thing ever. If you guys haven't watched the video where we discover a tiny little magical door in the kids' closet in their bedroom, make sure you guys go check out that video. I'll have it linked up in the iCard. It is the craziest thing we've ever seen. It lights up, it like changes colors, like underneath it it's like so weird and we definitely need your guys help on like how to open it what is going on and how did it show up we're like so confused the boys have been just like trying to find clues as to how to get in there so anyways make sure you guys go check out that video of us finding it it is the craziest thing you'll ever see okay guys we need to talk we had a little bit of a, a situation that happened so a few days ago Brian and I walked outside and we found Ollie with a shovel trying to dig up one of his old pets. And at first we like totally were like, whoa, 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 what do you think you're doing? You cannot do that. About four years ago when Ollie was like literally just learning to walk, we got him his very first pet and it was a fish, a betta fish. And we named him hashtag Bruce Norbert. And we had him for three years or so. He was definitely one of our like beloved fishes. I mean, we talked about him a lot on the vlogs. You guys might even remember him. He was just like a fun, easy pet for Ollie to have, just to like feed every once in a while. But unfortunately, he's a fish and he did pass away about a year ago. And we actually did do a video about how he had died and all that. We did bury him in the backyard in a little box. I think there might even be like a note inside the box. So anyways, when we found Oliver in the backyard trying to dig him up, we quickly just kind of like talked to him and said, you know, you really aren't supposed to dig up your pets. When things die, you kind of remember them in your heart and you miss them and it was really fun having them and it's always hard. You kind of have to move on. But he just was not having it for that answer. And I, me and Brian kind of took a step back and we kind of talked and we decided it's just curiosity. He's he's a little kid and he's curious as I think a lot of kids would be. I know that when I was a kid, I had this salamander that I loved. I had lots of animals and he passed away and I buried him in my backyard in a box, same kind of thing. And I remember like trying to find him one time, like digging him up and I could not find him, but it's normal. Like it's he's not digging up a dog or a cat, it's tiny, tiny little fish. If we navigate through this correctly and if we help him with his curiosity, we can just help him one, feel confident that we won't laugh at him and tell him to knock it off and that's no and he can't do it. And it's a very innocent thing I think for him to do. Obviously this is just our parenting choice and something that we are okay with. And maybe not every parent would be okay with it, but it is just a fish. <laughs> After many, many conversations and talks with him, I'm going to allow him to attempt to dig it up. <laughs> And I actually want to see what Brian thinks, have him tell you his thoughts about the whole thing. All right, Brian is sitting at his desk and I just told them about the situation where Oliver wants to dig up his old fish. Oh, hashtag. <laughs> yes. That was so weird. I, of course, navigated through it by tweeting about it because that's what millennials <laughs> do. Um, and it was actually really funny too because Twitter even tweeted me and said, rest in peace, hashtag Bruce Norbert. And I thought that was just really cool. I feel like at first, like you kind of were like, no, not happening. Maybe don't let him do that. <laughs> I feel like it's a completely normal fascination. I mean, it's an innocent idea. Totally. He kind of just needs to learn. Yeah. It's on the other side. I totally agree. And obviously, if this was like our cat or our dog, we would be like, nope, sorry, yeah, that's not that's happening. True. Also, it's the month of October. Yes, so kind of exactly. Funny that, like, 
what, like two weeks before Halloween, he's like, I want to dig up my dead I know. <laughs> what if we actually find a zombie fish? A zombie fish? And I actually think this is one of those moments that we're going to remember forever. When Ollie was five years old, he was out there trying to dig up his pet fish, and he even says, well, I'm going to find him and I'm going to put him in the fish tank. He wants to just find his pet fish and put him in the fish tank. It's the cutest <laughs> Which, thing. that was his original thought process, and we had to walk him through, like, it's it's not going to be alive, Ollie. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Listen, Ollie, the fish is definitely not alive because fish need water to live, right? I am putting it in the fish tank. Like, I can't believe we actually caught it on camera and that we're going to be able to remember it like forever, that moment when he was five years yeah. old and really thought he could dig his fish up and put it in the fish tank. So let's see how it goes. <gasps> All right, next we're going to go talk to Ollie and grab him and go start digging. But thumbs up this video if you guys have ever had a pet or if you've ever loved a pet, because Ollie's had lots of pets, and at this point he's buried quite a few uh, animals in our backyard. All right, there's Ollie. How's it going? You playing? Yeah. We've been talking a lot about hashtag, right? You still want to dig up hashtag, is yeah. that correct? Yeah. And why do you want to do that? Because I love him. Because you love him. And what are you hoping that you will find? I'm hoping I could find him. You just want to find him. Do you think he's going to be alive? I know he's dead, but I just see. You just want to see? Yeah. Just kind of curious? Okay, so what do you think? Do you think it's going to be a little weird? Do you think it's going to be like a little creepy? What do you think? I think it's going to be fine. You think it's going to be fine? Yeah. All right, well, I think we're definitely going to need to f get Papa to help us out, okay? He might be here right now. Yeah, I think he is here right now. So we're going to go grab him and go attempt to see if we can even find Hashtag. We know where we buried him. Let's go show him where we buried him. It's over here. Okay, let's go look. You can kind of look. We've actually already attempted to uh, see if we could find anything and we could not, right? That's why we are recruiting Papa's help. We buried him under this uh, big tree next to this rock. Because um, I remember when I sit here. Yes, you can sit here and you can remember hashtag, huh? We actually had that little stone on top of it, but the stone has been moved. Look He's that. somewhere over here. That's kind of like the general area. We're gonna have to get like a good shovel and see what we can do, okay? Okay. All right, Dad is here. He's ready to help us yeah. do this. What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> I guess we will see. All right, Ollie, you're pretty sure he's over here, right? Yep. So we got a sharp shovel, and Papa's got a sharp shovel, and uh, we're gonna try and do this. No. Are you sure this is where he was? We're pretty sure. I thought he was right under this rock, right where this rock was, so we, he oh, could yeah, sit yeah. here. Because I don't think I went this deep. Really? Hmm, maybe it's over a little. All right, we're still digging. You guys trying to find it? Yep, Brian's here. We, we, we didn't we put it right here next to this rock? I thought we did. I thought I put a rock over it. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure that rock's been moved a million times. So Ollie, when we dig him up, what's the first thing you're gonna tell him? I don't know. Are you gonna tell him about our fish tank and all our other fish we got? <laughs> You're not sure? Maybe just tell him like, I miss you, hashtag. I'm hashtag was like the inspiration for our whole that fish was tank. My I know. Pet when I was little. It was yeah. Your, your I remember right. the day you brought him home all the time. Your face was so excited when we got him, huh? Yeah. You were like, ah. Um, we're having a little bit of a hard time, guys. We are not finding any box back here. Karma, did you dig up a box? <laughs> What do you think we're gonna find? Do you think we're gonna find hashtag or nothing? Comment down below. All right guys, comment down below. What are they gonna find? Yes, your eyes do not deceive you. This is my family digging up their dead pet fish. So I actually went back and I found a picture. Not having any luck. Okay, I think we might have found, oh my goodness. Is that it, Ollie? There it is. So this is definitely the box because it's got a little anchor on it, right? Yep, that's it. He did it, we found hashtag! Okay. I actually didn't, I, I didn't think this would happen. All right, so here it is. It's all kind of like, it is very dirty. It's It kind of looks like the wood's a little bit warped because it's been in wetness and the ground. Yeah, so here's the anchor. 
Pretty cool. Wow. Yeah. Well, see, we I told you we buried him. I want to open it. Why do you want to open it? I want to open it because I love him. I think I popped it open. Let's see. Okay. All right, there is a note. There is a note in here. I think we can just pull the note out and maybe that would make him kind yeah, of Yeah, pull the note out. Excited. Wow. Look at this. Did you and Ollie do that? Yeah. I hope it actually unravels because it was paper. But it says loved by millions. <laughs> YouTube.com slash daily bumps. There was this little note and we can maybe try and open it and see what it says. Yeah, let's open it. Okay, let's see. <laughs> Ooh, I don't know if it's gonna unravel. Yeah, it's like pretty. It's too old. Yeah. If, I think if I tear it, I think if I do that, it's just gonna tear. Oh. Oh, there's like totally like writing in this. That's so cute. Well, let's not let's not mess it up, Ollie. So let's just leave it in there, okay? Yeah, let's leave it in there for now, okay? It's for hashtag. So it says loved by millions. YouTube.com/slash daily bumps. Isn't that funny? So we put it on it so that they can watch who he is. And watch the videos of you getting him for the first time, yeah, huh? That's so cool. All right, Ollie, so what did you think of that? It was great, but it was gross. Yeah, it was. Well, are you glad you did it? Yeah. Yeah, you feel like it was a good decision? Mm -hmm. Okay, and what did you learn? I learned about don't dig them all. <laughs> that's true, huh? You're like, okay, never going to dig up a fish or an animal again, right? Yes. Um, yeah, it was definitely a little creepy and gross, but I don't really feel bad about it. I definitely feel like he was like, okay, that was gross, not gonna do that again. I don't feel like it was traumatizing at all. I feel like he was like, hmm, interesting. Done with that. I'm so glad we can have that behind us. Good night, hashtag, and good to see you back.